As the British royal family goes through a period of upheaval and transformation, two prominent members of the family, Prince Harry and Prince Andrew, face an uncertain future within the monarchy. Prince Andrew, Duke of York and Prince Harry during the royal procession on the third day of Ascot at Ascot Racecourse on June 19, 2014, in Ascot, England. Photo by Chris Jackson slash Getty Images for Ascot Racecourse, there seems to be a belief that under King Charles's leadership, there will be no return for the two princes to their former roles. Those sentiments were reinforced by a recent poll showing more than half of Britons want Prince Harry to be removed from the line of succession. According to a report by Express UK on Wednesday, August 16, 2023, presenter Esther Krakow's comments further reinforced the view that there was no going back for Harry and Andrew. To the royal family. The scaling assessment comes amid mounting speculation and debate over Prince Harry and Prince Andrew's role in the monarchy. According to Krakow, the two princes are in a similar situation regarding their possible re-entry into public life. The prevailing mood suggests that the British public, like King Charles himself, is not keen on her return. Krakow's remarks gained widespread attention after Prince Harry performed at the coronation of King Charles in May. While some may have interpreted this as a possible sign of reconciliation between father and son, Krakow believes the gesture was purely symbolic. According to her, Prince Charles invited Harry to the most important event of his life out of respect, not as a step toward reintegration into the royal family. British opinion is a key factor behind reluctance to reintegrate. Cracky points out that King Charles feels a lack of public enthusiasm for the return of his brother Prince Andrew and son Prince Harry to public life. Prince Andrew, Duke of York and Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex, walk behind the coffin during a procession for Queen Elizabeth II, September 14, 2022, London, England. Photo. Kate Green slash Getty Images, that sentiment is reflected in the results of a recent poll, which showed that over 50% of Britons would like to see Prince Harry removed from the line of succession. It suggests a growing distance between the public and the younger generation of royals, making a possible return to royal duties even more difficult for Harry and Andrew. The complex circumstances surrounding Prince Harry and Prince Andrew undoubtedly contributed to this narrative. Prince Andrew's affair with the late financier and convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein cast a shadow over his reputation and led to his retirement from public office in 2019. Perception remains significantly impaired. Likewise, Prince Harry's departure from royal duties and his subsequent candid interviews about the challenges of royal life and his strained relationship with his family have drawn both admiration and controversy. His decision to step down from his official duties and move to the United States with his wife Meghan Markle has sparked discussions about the role and importance of the modern monarchy. Against this background, the reluctance to reinstate Prince Harry and Prince Andrew can be seen as part of a broader strategy to redefine the image and role of the British royal family in the modern world. As the future head of the monarchy, King Charles faces the delicate task of balancing tradition with changing public expectations. This delicate balance requires careful consideration of how to preserve the dignity of the institution while accommodating public opinion. Thanks for watching, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on the notification bell for more royal family updates. Thank you, see you next time.